In this video, I'll demonstrate how to configure directed broadcast or multicast threshold settings in the Advanced Network Settings menu using the Ruckus Cloud Wi-Fi portal using a computer browser user interface. Multicast or broadcast traffic goes to a group of devices over a wireless LAN. As such, no acknowledgement comes back from the client as the packets are to be received by multiple clients. Typically, these can be gaming applications or Apple Bonjour devices or servers or things like this. By default, Ruckus APs deliver broadcast and multicast packets as unicast packets and sends them to the clients attached to the wireless LAN. Although unicast packets have higher data rates and get acknowledgements back, it creates more traffic over the air, so there is a threshold after which the AP will say enough is enough, and it will send multicast or broadcast packets just the way it was meant to be. The directed broadcast multicast threshold setting in the advanced network settings Define a limit above which broadcast and multicast are delivered as group packets and not unicast packets. It is based on a per radio client count, at which time the AP will stop converting group address data traffic to unicast traffic. So to set this up from the dashboard, I'll go to the networks. And as a note, this setting can be done on any type of network, so I'll select one of my pre-shared key networks. And if I go to edit the network, under the Advanced tab, if I scroll down, you will see the Directed Multicast Broadcast Threshold. And it says it's a per radio client count, at which time the AP will stop converting group address data traffic to unicast. And if I roll over the arrow, it gives me a description. And it says the Directed Threshold value and action is checked by the AP after it has performed other multicast handling actions, such as SmartCast, and such as application detection and checking IGMP subscription of clients. Due to the order of actions on some traffic, the Directed Threshold may not be the final determinant in multicast frame handling. So the default value is 5, and I can increase that or decrease that as I want to. So, for example, if I had 10 or 15 clients out here that might be gaming type of machines or might be Apple type devices, I might want to increase this. So I'll cancel on that. Let me just look at another example of a network. I go back to my network settings. I'll pick my cloud path. And I'll go to edit networks on that one. And I'll go to the advanced tab. And if I scroll down, you'll see once again that we have our directed multicast broadcast threshold setting here. By default, once again, it's set at 5. So this feature was added in release 18.03. So this was just a short video to show how to configure the directed broadcast and multicast threshold settings in the Advanced Network Setting menu using the Ruckus Cloud Wi-Fi portal. 